Did you know some foods can lower your testosterone levels? Yes, you heard that right. It's not just about what you eat to boost this vital hormone, but also about what you might need to avoid. Testosterone, the primary male sex hormone, plays a vital role in our bodies influencing everything from muscle mass to mood. What we consume can have a significant impact on our testosterone levels. In today's video we'll be shedding light on 13 foods that have been associated with potentially lowering testosterone levels. We'll be discussing everything from soy products and flax seeds, which contain plant compounds that can mimic estrogen, to processed foods and alcohol, which can contribute to insulin resistance and inflammation. We'll also touch on some items that might surprise you, like mint and microwave popcorn. Stay tuned as we delve into the details of these foods and how they may affect your testosterone levels. Let's get started. First on our list are soy products and flax seeds. These two are quite popular in the health-conscious community. However, they come with a little twist. Both soy and flax seeds contain plant compounds known as phytoestrogens. These compounds have a fascinating ability to mimic estrogen, a hormone, in our bodies. Now you might be wondering, what's the issue with that? Well, when phytoestrogens imitate estrogen, they can potentially reduce testosterone levels. This is because the body may get tricked into thinking it already has enough of these hormones, thus, slowing down its own production. It's important to note that this doesn't mean you should completely eliminate soy products and flax seeds from your diet. They are, after all, rich in protein and other important nutrients. It simply means that moderation might be key when it comes to these foods. Balancing your diet with a variety of foods can help ensure you're getting a mix of different nutrients without overdoing it on any one thing. So, moderation might be key when it comes to soy products and flax seeds. Next up, we have processed foods and alcohol. The allure of processed foods is undeniable. They're convenient and often delicious. However, these foods are typically high in sugar, unhealthy fats, and artificial additives. This lethal cocktail can contribute to insulin resistance and inflammation, two factors that can negatively impact testosterone levels. It's a classic case of short-term pleasure leading to long-term pain. Now let's talk about alcohol. A casual drink here and there is generally harmless but excessive consumption is a different story. Too much alcohol can interfere with hormone production and liver function. This disruption can potentially lead to lower testosterone levels. It's yet another reason to practice moderation when it comes to our drinking habits. In essence both processed foods and excessive alcohol consumption can be detrimental to our testosterone levels. It seems a healthy diet isn't just good for your waistline but also your testosterone levels. Moving on we look at mint and licorice. Both are common ingredients in candies and herbal teas but did you know they might influence testosterone levels? Mint, particularly in the form of peppermint and spearmint extracts, has been suggested to exhibit anti-androgenic effects. These effects could potentially lower testosterone levels, though the exact impact can vary between individuals and is influenced by overall diet and lifestyle. On the other hand, licorice root, a popular natural sweetener, contains compounds that may inhibit testosterone production. When consumed in large amounts, licorice can increase cortisol levels, a stress hormone that can further impact the balance of hormones in the body. So, while enjoying your favorite mint candy or sipping on a licorice-infused beverage, it's worth considering how these flavorsome treats could be influencing your hormone balance. Certainly interesting to think about next time you enjoy a mint or licorice treat. Now let's discuss trans fats and high sugar foods. Trans fats, often lurking in fried foods, baked goods and processed snacks, have been linked to inflammation, which can impact hormone levels negatively, including testosterone. This is because inflammation can interrupt the body's ability to produce testosterone effectively, thus leading to reduced levels of this hormone. On the other hand, diets high in sugar can lead to insulin resistance. Insulin resistance disrupts the body's hormone balance which can lower testosterone levels. Excessive sugar intake can cause a spike in insulin levels, which might suppress the production of testosterone. It's important to understand that while these foods might be delicious, their potential impact on your health and hormone balance could be significant. Making conscious choices about what we eat and opting for a balanced low-sugar diet can go a long way in maintaining healthy testosterone levels. It's becoming clear that a balanced low-sugar diet can be beneficial for maintaining healthy testosterone levels. Next on our list are mint tea and certain vegetable oils. As we've mentioned earlier, mint extracts have been suggested to possess anti-androgenic effects and this extends to mint tea as well. Mint tea made from peppermint or spearmint leaves might also have the potential to reduce testosterone levels. 
Now, let's turn our attention to vegetable oils, specifically those high in omega-6 fatty acids such as soybean oil, corn oil, and sunflower oil. While these oils are often a staple in many kitchens, they may not be as harmless as they appear. Consuming these oils in excess may promote inflammation, which could potentially lead to lower testosterone levels. It's fascinating how everyday items in our pantry can have such profound effects on our bodies, isn't it? Remember, moderation is key. So, while we're not suggesting you ban these items from your kitchen, it might be worth considering their effects. Another reason to be mindful of the oils used in your cooking. Finally, we have baked goods, fast food, and microwave popcorn. These are the foods that we often resort to when we're in a hurry or just looking for a quick snack. But the convenience of these foods comes with a cost, and it's not just about the extra pounds. Starting with baked goods, these delightful treats are often made with refined carbohydrates, unhealthy fats, and added sugars. Sounds delicious, right? But here's the catch. These ingredients can contribute to insulin resistance and inflammation. And remember, inflammation and insulin resistance are not friends with testosterone. They have a knack for disrupting its balance, potentially leading to lower levels of this crucial hormone. Next, let's talk about fast food. It's quick, it's easy, and let's face it, it can be pretty tasty. But fast food meals are typically high in unhealthy fats, refined carbohydrates, and sodium. These ingredients can negatively impact hormone levels and overall health. The more we indulge in these foods, the more we risk messing with our testosterone levels. Lastly, we have microwave popcorn. Who doesn't love a good movie night with a bowl of popcorn? But did you know that the lining of microwave popcorn bags often contains perfluorooctanoic acid or PFOA? This chemical may disrupt hormone balance and potentially lower testosterone levels. So, while we're enjoying our favorite flick, we might also be unknowingly munching on something that's messing with our hormones. As we've seen, food plays a significant role in our hormone balance. Many of the foods we consume daily have the potential to lower our testosterone levels, but it's not all doom and gloom. Armed with this knowledge, we can make better food choices. Opting for whole foods, cutting down on processed foods, and being mindful of our consumption can make a huge difference. It seems that making healthier food choices can do more than just keep the doctor away. In conclusion, diet plays a significant role in maintaining healthy testosterone levels. The foods we've discussed today from soy products and flax seeds to processed foods and alcohol all have the potential to lower testosterone levels. Mint, licorice, trans fats, high sugar foods, mint tea, certain vegetable oils, commercially baked goods, fast food, and even microwave popcorn can all contribute to this effect. However, it's not just about avoiding these 13 foods. It's about understanding that what we consume directly impacts our hormone levels, including testosterone. Consuming a diet high in processed foods, unhealthy fats, and sugars can lead to insulin resistance, inflammation, and hormonal imbalance. It's vital to remember that these effects are not guaranteed in every individual, as the impact of these foods on testosterone levels can vary based on personal factors and overall diet. For some, the effects might be negligible, but for others, they might be significant. It's also important to note that some of these foods, like soy, flax seeds, and certain vegetable oils, have other health benefits and should not be entirely excluded from the diet. Instead, they should be consumed in moderation as part of a balanced and diverse diet. This discussion is not meant to create fear or demonize these foods, but to increase awareness about the potential effects of certain foods on our hormone levels. The key takeaway is the importance of balance. A healthy diet is one that includes a variety of foods in the right proportions. So the next time you're about to indulge in your favorite fast food or reach for that bag of microwave popcorn, remember the potential impact on your testosterone levels? Consider making healthier choices like opting for fresh fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains instead. Remember, share this video with others who might benefit from the information. And don't forget to click on the notification bell for future videos. Stay healthy and see you in the next video.